Oh, hey, girl, hey. First and foremost, ladies, if I sound out of breath, please excuse me. This is literally the third time I'm recording this video. We're having some technical difficulties over here. But I hope you ladies are having a great week. And I wanted to start by saying I hope you all know me well enough to understand that if you don't see my face for a couple of days or if I don't post a video within a week, there's really only one explanation for it. And it's because I'm at home with my head down working on something truly amazing for you guys. So this week, I wanna go ahead and jump into key eight of excessive elevation, which is set goals. And honestly, I am just completely beside myself this week because we have a huge surprise for you guys. Now, if you've signed up to our mailing list, then you got the announcement last night and you're already ahead of the game. So I just wanna say thanks, sis, I appreciate you. But for those of you who haven't signed up to the mailing list yet, make sure you do that so you can get announcements before things are released publicly. But this week, the surprise that we have for you guys who did not get the announcement is we are releasing our first online training program. And I'm so excited about it. So if you guys haven't already, go to the link in our bio and check out the Ultimate Girl's Guide to Gold Mining. This is a 60 minute audio presentation with workbook examples and a free 15 page downloadable workbook for you ladies to go ahead and go get yourself some goals. Now we're only offering this program for free for one month, but before you guys go jump into the course, I really do want to take a minute to just talk about goals in general. And really just like with anything else in life, if you don't know what you're working towards, then what's the point of working at all? I mean, really, think about waking up at 5 a.m. every day and getting dressed and going to an office and running around for eight hours or more a day. That means that you're dedicating five days out of your week to completing tasks for other people, which is ultimately putting money in in someone else's pocket, right? But let's say that you go to work for five days a week and you make it to Friday evening only to realize that you didn't get a paycheck. Now, I'll wait. It <laughs> sounds ridiculous, right? Now, don't get me wrong. I'm sure there are circumstances. If you're volunteering or interning, to get experience or really give back to your community. All of those are amazing things. But for general purposes, most people go to work to get a paycheck. And every day, you know exactly why you're pushing yourself out of bed at 5 a.m. You know exactly what the end goal is. And you know exactly why you're doing the things that you don't always want to do in order to get what you want. You go to work to get a paycheck. Now, I'm sure that for most people, the paycheck has deeper meaning. You're probably trying to provide for your family or pay your bills or save some money to start your own business. But the bottom line is, you know exactly why you're doing the things you don't wanna do, which is go to work for someone else, in order to get what you want, which is get a paycheck. So my question is, why don't we look at every single area of our lives in the same manner? If you want to grow, you have to have goals set for every area of your life, whether it's your health or your finances or your career or your own business and really even your relationships. At the end of the day, like I truly believe that we all have two options. You can either make life happen, or you can let life happen. But if you don't really understand the value of being intentional, then you're basically going through life at 90 miles an hour, closing your eyes and gripping onto your seatbelt, hoping that you make it out alive if and when that car crashes. Just like going on a journey in a car, life is a journey. You should have a destination. You should know where you're going and you should know how you're gonna get there. You need to have a plan. And 
you have to take action. And even further than that, when you begin taking action, you have to be comfortable with evaluating your progress and ensuring that what you're doing is actually working. Now, I know all of this may sound easier said than done, especially if you've never set goals before or if you're you're new to this idea in general um, or if you're anything like I was 10 years ago and you're just cool with winging it. And if that's you, then do you, sis? Like, I'm not mad at you at all. But if you're somebody who can't quite put your finger on something specific, but deep down you know that you want to get, do, be, see, and achieve just more out of life, then the Ultimate Girl's Guide to Gold Mining is definitely for you. In this program, I've laid out nine easy steps that anybody, I mean anybody, can use to get exactly what they want by the end of this year. So no matter who you are or where you are, I've designed the program to meet you exactly where you are right now. So just to give you guys a little bit of an overview, I actually created the program about four years ago to help ensure that I was working towards the things that I wanted and really hold myself accountable and learn how to just get out of my own way. I wanted all of these things and I wanted them all right now. And I just didn't know how to work towards them simultaneously without burning myself out or driving myself crazy. And what happens is a lot of people don't take things step by step. You look at the bigger picture of everything that you want. You try to do it all at once and then you just end up giving up on everything. So in this program, we've really designed each step to help you clearly define what it is that you want and specify your non-negotiables. And then once you're comfortable with understanding what you are and aren't willing to do in order to get what you want, we help you set goals that will result in getting what those things are by the end of this year. In each step of the program, we really help you move along to the end goal, which is getting exactly what it is that you want. And we help you create a precise action plan that doesn't require you to recreate your entire life. I really want to help you guys get a clear understanding of how to evaluate your progress going forward. Once you start taking action and you begin creating new habits, you have to know how to make adjustments when needed. Like if things aren't working, how are you going to evaluate that and how are you going to make adjustments going forward without getting overwhelmed or getting off track or just giving up? So ladies, go take the course, go get your free workbook. And I'm challenging all of you this week to get you some goals. Now we need 10 of you queens to send us a video with your workbook and just a few key points of what you got out of the program. I'm so excited to see all of the things that you guys are gonna accomplish this year. And I really cannot wait to hear your feedback. Now, keep in mind, I'm an artist and I'm sensitive about my shit. <laughs> Have a good week, ladies.